The Hamilton Tiger Cats beat the Winnipeg Blue Bombers 37-18 on Friday night. This was the game the Tiger Cats were supposed to win. Winnipeg is in chaos uh, with a you know rookie starting quarterback who's never played in the CFL before. They've got some uncertainty in the front office, having just fired the general manager. But traditionally, the Tiger Cats have had trouble winning the games that they were supposed to win, and so. Uh, this is, a, I think, a, a good sign for this Ticat team. It was a balanced effort. Offense played uh, quite well. They had that uh, dual-headed quarterback attack with both uh, Henry Burris and Dan Lefevre getting, getting time. Uh, a number of receivers were contributing, including Greg Ellingson, including Sam Shaguer, including Bakari Grant. C.J. Gable had a, a good all-round game. So lots of good things on offense. They only turned the ball over uh, once, uh, and, and it was late in the fourth quarter uh, at a time when the game was essentially uh, decided. And the defense played pretty well uh, as well. Uh, generated four turnovers, two sacks, and, and basically played uh, quite well. So uh, I think that's, that's, a, that's the best sign for the Ticats, which you know, they've had to defend, depend on their offense to win games over the last you know, year and a half or so, and this was a, a more balanced, a balanced attack. And so that, I think, is a, is a good sign. Talking with Ken Austin after the game, he was he was happy. Uh, I think concerned about penalties. Certainly, uh, there were some defensive penalties in particular that kept uh, bomber drives alive, and that's something that they'll certainly have to clean up. Clean up. But overall, I think uh, you know you have to be happy with this win uh, if you're a Ticat fan. Now, second half of this home and home set goes next Saturday in Guelph. An opportunity for the Ticats to get back to 500. The Bombers obviously be even more desperate now. They're uh, one in five and. Uh, you know, they, they need to start winning some games or they could be out of the playoff race before Labor Day. So uh, it should be a very interesting matchup. So reporting from Investors Group Field in Winnipeg for the Hamilton Spectator, I'm Drew Edwards.